Hello, everybody. So today, I just recently got the um, early Cretaceous pack for the Jurassic World Evolution 2, and I know I've been uplo I haven't been uploading it, so I kind of wanted to give you guys a little overview. I know I'm a month late, but um, you know, let's just have fun. Check it out. So as you can see, um. We have the lagoon creatures, the aviary creatures, and the um, land creatures. For the land creatures, we got a Wurrosaurus, or Wurrosaurus. I'm just going to call it a Wuhuahuasaurus. Um, for the lagoon, we got a, uh, what's it called, a Leopleurodon? No, Chronosaurus, which um, I was hoping to get, because it will look like the one from JP, the JP game. Uh, and then we also got, um, Sungariptus. Sungariptus, I think that's it. Sungariptus. So, um, Sungariptus. So we're gonna check all of them out. We're gonna start with the land dinosaur, the Wuhuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuahuah
gonna do it? I mean, they're right next to each other. Are they gonna do it? No, they're just like playing around. Relatively small armored herbivore from Cretaceous Australia. What sets this species apart from other members of its family are the horizontally orientated plates. Here we go. He's like biting on his tail, and then he's like, "No, don't do that." Look, he's doing it again. He's biting on his tail, and then he's like, "No." I do want to see if we can get the little rollover emote because in the trailer it shows them roll over. So maybe if we could do that, that would be really cute. Oh, I'm being called. Oh boy. Um. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Oh my gosh. Hold on, guys. Uh, tell me if you see a rolling emote. A rolling animation. Oh, my internet's terrible. Uh, I'll tell them later. <laughs> okay, so, uh, come on. Do a little rolling emote. Do they only do it when they're when they get out of the water, maybe? Oh, wait, I don't have... No, I have water in this enclosure. Hmm. And then you guys want to just roll over real quick? Here. I'll speed it up. See if maybe they'll roll over then. You know, when it's nice and speed up. Sped up. Come on, do a nice little roll. Oh, he's doing the little animation. Oh, they're panicking. Okay. Okay, now they're in the sand, so they might do a bit more rolling. I do want to see it, though, so... Oh, is he doing it? I think he is just chilling. Yeah, he was just chilling. I know this. Is, we're, I know you guys, it's probably boring for you guys because we're just waiting around to see these guys roll. But trust me, it is adorable seeing these guys do it. Come on, just roll over for me. Roll over and roll around. That one. If not, go check out Jurassic World Evolution's um, 2's channel. They posted the trailer on there, um, and there's a little footage in the background. If you pay attention, um, the mid me rolling roll. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, I just missed it. All right, we're going to keep on these mid -me's. Oh, oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Look at this. Look at this. Hold on. Look at it. So he's rolling around. He's trying to get on his back. Oh, look at that. He's trying to like roll around and stuff. That's so cute. I knew they'd eventually do it. It's a really cute animation. And it's just him like trying to get up on his back, rolling around. You know, getting his plates all nice and cleaned. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, he's up on his back. And he's back on the ground. That's so, that's actually really adorable. That is so cute. Okay, I recommend these Min Mai. If you get this pack, I do recommend these Min Mai. They are super adorable and pretty easy to take care of. They're not too picky if you modify them to um, be not picky. I think this guy's just chilling. He's not going to do the rolling emote. Um, rolling. Uh, why do I keep calling him emote? Uh, animation. Um, and yeah, let's go to the next dinosaur. Or, what should I say? Marine reptile. The next one is the Chronosaurus. Um, very beautiful, very beautiful creature. Uh, I like it a lot. <laughs> um, this one again, I just put a random pattern, and then the other two are base patterns, which I'll check 
and I really want to see if they can do because this is the only this is uh, Champlain Valley blank pattern, and this is Salar del Husco blank pattern, and I want to see if you can get one of them because look how many shark feeders I put here. I want to see if. We can get these guys to eat a shark. I'm gonna speed it up a bit. Oh, is this guy gonna do it? Doesn't look like it. Is that a guy right down here? V is? Is he? I don't think he is. No way, is this guy gonna do it? Come on, don't disappoint. Oh, I disappointed. Oh, wait, no, he didn't. Is he going for it? No, he's not. Come on, bro. Can I have one of you guys eat from the shark feeder? Alright, well, we'll watch you. I mean, they're pretty cool looking, I gotta admit. Um... Yeah, they're definitely cool looking. I love them. Uh, they're actually a decent size, but still nothing compared to Mosasaurus. Mosasaurus can actually fight these guys, which I thought was interesting when I saw it. Um, fortunately, we don't have a Mosasaurus incubated, so... And I don't want you guys waiting, so we'll just, you know, hang off on that. I really want to see these guys eat the shark, because it's got a different animation that I do very much appreciate from uh, Frontier. I'm gonna speed it up again. See if you can see the animations just like the Min Mai. Any of the one, two, three, four, five, what, nine shark feeders I place down? Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight shark feeders. You got eight shark feeders. Come on. You gotta at least eat from one of them. Oh, oh my gosh. All right, so what he does is he jumps up from the water, grabs the shark, wiggles around, struggles a bit, and then tears it and then goes back into the water. Oh, another, they're doing it again. So he struggles, he swings it around, struggles a bit, and then eventually just tears it. Like look at that, struggles a bit, and it, like floats around. Um, like kind of pulling on the strings and stuff, the wiring, and see the half shark there. It leaves it in half, just like the Mosasaurus, but it struggles to do it because it's, you know, smaller. So I like that animation. It's a bit uh, different for the Mosasaurus, definitely a unique and cool. Um, it's just the only other, um, one that, it's the only other, uh, sea dweller that will eat shark but they but what's weird is they ask for fish it says food fish so they want fish but they can eat sharks so i'm kind of confused by that but it's okay because you know they're still awesome so if you can get it one more time is this guy gonna do it no Okay, gonna do it. He might. Oh, it looks like he's diving up. Is he gonna go for it? I think he is. Alright, I knew it. So we have the Carnosaurus jumps up. He pulls the string down, wiggles around a bit, left and right, left and right, and right, finally tugs it off and body flops into the water. I really like that. That's actually a cool. A, you know, it's a decent and cool, creative way to kind of um, put a spin on the Mosasaurus animation. The last one is the last um, uh, dinosaur or creature in this early Cretaceous pack is the Sungripterus, um, the a pterosaur. You can put him in aviaries, obviously. That's what I'm doing. And he actually runs out. That's interesting. I've never seen a reptile on its two legs. That's actually really cool. 
He like ran out of the hatchery and then took like lift off. That's really cool. I've never seen that. So this guy is Gambia River Basin with um, lithobates um, pattern. Once again, I, this is the only guy I'm releasing. And then the other ones, these aren't all the patterns, but these are some of them. Sungraptus 1. The Sungraptus 1 is Sonoran Desert. Again, blank. Number 2 is Death Valley, which I think looks pretty cool. It's like a red sand. And then over here we have Champlain Valley. I like Swamp Green. I like it. And then we have Sala del Jusco. Come on. He is obviously resting. Blank pattern. It's like a kind of greenish red tropical, which looks kind of good. Then we have Limpo River. Here's a better view on him. Uh, and then we, of course, we go up. But uh, Limpo River looks pretty good. Um, I love the shape of their skull. It looks really cool. Uh, um, Quillane Mountains. Again, this guy is resting. It's got like a purplish, reddish white, which I like to it. It's got a nice um, shade. And then we go back to the first one. So we got seven the Sun Grifters in here. I don't know if they have a special animation. I could check what if they're doing at the feeders. But I don't think they have any special animations. I can see. Hold on. Um, I think it's just the same old uh, animation. Yeah, he just grabs it. Grabs the fish. Throws it up in his mouth. Kind of scoops it up. I'm pretty sure that's what every single um, guy does. I don't know if they have like different fighting animations or something like that. Uh, they fly the same way. So these guys aren't like too. I mean, they look good, that's for sure. And they're running at it. Their uh, their release animation is really cool. I didn't even know that was a thing. So I like it. I like it a lot. My favorite dinosaur in this pack is probably either the Chronosaur, no, the Wahoo, uh, the Wahoo -hoo -hoo Asaurus, or the Minmai. The herbivores are pretty cool. I'm definitely more a fan of the land animals. You can do a lot more with them. Land dinosaurs you can do a lot more with them than you can do with the um, marine reptiles and pterosaurs. But, uh, or the pleosaurs and pterosaurs. But I'm still a fan of this update. I really like it. I hope you guys enjoyed. And um, I'll see you. I'll see you, Chads, later. That was cringe. Let me, re let me rephrase that. Let me... I'll see you awesome people later. Hope you enjoyed this little update. And, uh, yeah. Peace out.